Hmm. There you are. This week on Small Town Hustle Couple, we're going to... I don't know for sure, but uh, it'll be interesting. I was looking for that. They tolerate it. I wonder what these little things are. This is the last of it. This stuff right here, I didn't know what it was for sure, but we paid $4 for the lot. It's called a Megazord Dinosaur Lot Power Rangers. These little things are called chargers. Um, these, um, the charge or something like that. This is beyond me. I'm really not up on it, but this is the T-Rex gun. And like I said, we paid four for this. There is mm, probably 16 or more little chargers. Well, the gun and one of these and eight of these chargers um, are selling, have sold on eBay for $96. So that'll be a good, that was a good purchase. Okay, so my wife told me to keep an eye on these cabbage fresh things. We'll check them out. Trying to figure out how much. They're awfully busy, so I'm going to have to wait. Okay, so this was a box we showed you earlier from that yard sale where we spent $88. I was a collector of Cabbage Patch when I was little, back in the, I guess, 80s. Um, these are mostly from the 80s. So there's some McDonald's sets. Um, that are still in the packages back here. You know, um, some of them are duplicates that are opened. There's accessories. Some of them are, you know, have real hair. Some of them do not. Most of them are made of um, some kind of a plasticky material, right? Kind of a PVC. Yeah, so, but look, like this one is gonna need to be cleaned up, but it can be because it doesn't have the hair on it. But um, some of them are the little clippy ones. But the lady, she had been collecting them for a long, long time, and um, she just had a big set of them. Had been selling them for a dollar a piece. Um, there's even jewelry. Look at these necklaces. I think I'll here. come back and show the jewelry here in a little bit. No, it's just one scan over it while it's out. Okay. Here's a baby in this I little know, container. I know, that's a mini mini. Yeah. A little brush. Um, more necklaces. This is some cards. Card game. Um, she really collected everything, I guess, or someone did in their home. So this leads to this stuff over here, which we're gonna lay it out next after we pick up all this because there's just so many here. We looked up some comps. Um, they definitely are worth the dollar a piece that she was asking, but as a lot, which is probably how we will sell them, they're probably worth 25 or 30, not including all the stuff that we purchased in the box of 20. So they look good. I believe I counted 60 plus of these little, little dudes. And uh, now this one, I believe it was this one. I noticed is of a different material. It's kind I'm of gonna break. Oh, oh, yeah. Well, I don't want to lose any. And uh, yeah, a little accessory. There's another little accessory. And, and yeah, they just there's some of them are keychains. Um, some of them are bendable, posable. Um, others are not. Some McDonald's. It's just a kind of a mixture. We will probably do. I'm guessing we'll do one lot or maybe two at the most um, because we want to just sell them all. We don't want to piece them out. Um, it's very time consuming. If when somebody you have to sees do... one on here, obviously that they are very aware it's a rare one. Please contact us. But mm -hmm. I, I think that they're, you know, given the shape that they're in, they've been stored and they're kind of they kind of a some kind of film on them. We're gonna have to clean them up a little. Okay, moving on. Okay, so we are on. This is the last bit of our Cabbage Patch Kids stuff that we acquired. Uh, you might have seen earlier the necklaces that we had. Yeah, There's another one, new. 
Uh, what are these stamps. little things? Stamps? These are stampers. Like stamps. But they're Cabbage Patch stampers. I mean, obviously, they're going to need ink if anybody tries to use them again. But a collector, you know. A whole bunch of... Some of these are puffy stickers. Some of them are transfer stickers. Just some random... They kept everything. So, these some of it new with tags. Pin. I think, I think they were like a collector of Cabbage pin Patch and stuff. Pin and a ring. I think this is really neat. Vintage Valentines. Um, still plastic wrapped in the 42 Valentines with envelopes. There's some other cards, just cards. Um, uh, I saw the envelopes down below on too. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah I pulled them out so we can see them. Well, here's a, a pencil that hasn't been sharpened yet. Cabbage Patch book. Yeah. Now, I noticed one thing from the other stuff. It was from 1982 to about 1992. Yeah, so some I'm, of them. I, some of the McDonald's stuff was newer, like 1992, but there wasn't much of that. Um, here's more cards. Is that Valentine cards? Valentine's package, yep. Ah, yeah. Packages. Here's some a big sticker pack. And these are like paper dolls. You remember when you used to play with paper dolls? No, um, I never played with paper dolls, no. Well, no. I meant, okay, these are from 84, but you can like, no. but you can like, of course, pop this out and put clothes on your dolls. Ah, this is cool. That is. It's really very thick. Cool. Play school. Uh, is it like a four-piece puzzle or something it's, like that? I don't know what it is. Like oh, a, I, pull that I can't, out. I can't get it out. It's called it an eight-piece. Is that a tag? It was Price? a tag from one of the other things. Oh, okay. Here's some Cabbage Patch, patch books. Yeah, now I know nothing about the books. We haven't comped any of oh, this. Yeah, they put $35 uh, for all three. I, but um, there's four there. There's so. this old Sears tag on here. Sears. Hmm. Yeah. Um... There's the top of this, and but this is a what is it? A, it's a dress up set. Yeah, oh, these are like little plasticky. Yeah, outfits. so you can just stick the, put them over the bloomers. Bloomers. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Bloomers. Is that yeah. even a word? I'm sure. It is, uh, yeah. Here's some party stuff. Some party happy spice. birthday and some plates and a party favorite. That's pretty cool. Oh, did these go on? Oh, it's crayons, crayons, character crayons. That is just so neat. Oh, and one last thing. Uh, this right here, when I saw it. The head was off, and I didn't know what it was. I thought it was just broke. But this is for blowing bubbles, you know, so you could send this to school with your child full of bubble-blowing material, and they could blow bubbles in class. No, I would never know who it was. Okay, my wife didn't enjoy that. Okay, so this is it. Hope you all enjoyed. Let us know if you see anything that we have missed. We, like we said, we haven't comped this stuff. Uh, this was part of the $20 bundle. In the $88. In the $88 bundle. Yeah. yeah, so this was, so we figured we had 20 in this. Over here to this um, United States. It's like a 1968. It's covered in some plastic, but it was used, obviously. Um, I told him we needed to pick it up. This was also at the same place with the camera that they used to be, I think, eBay sellers. Yes. But they were trying to sell out so they could travel or something. Uh, and they had their house for sale. All yeah. that. Yeah, they're selling out of stuff. So uh, we, we should have spent more time there. We should have, you know. Anyway, they wanted um, a quarter for this, and we comped it nine ninety nine. And and think about it right now, coronavirus. It yes, is it's it is September. We still have coronavirus. September twenty twenty. So yep. all of parents are having to homeschool. Great puzzle for yep. the United States. Nineteen sixty eight. Yeah. Okay. Here is a Melissa and Doug. I always look for the Melissa and Doug, and this one was new. It has a nineteen ninety nine tag on it, but they were asking five. We put it in that bundle with eighty eight dollars. I don't know what we actually paid for it. But it is worth, like, I found a comp for 34 with free shipping. So, it's definitely worth, you know, it's definitely worth what we gave for it and then some. So, this will be easy to ship, too. It's very it's lightweight. the felt. The, and the Melissa and Doug is a lot of times the, the wooden stuff or the felt. Still new. But, the, mean, but the wooden, you know, is, of course, heavier to ship. All there the pluses. This. Uh, this was uh, a very interesting piece. Uh, we had... Same place, eBay place. Yes, this was the... the people we that found, were selling their house. Was there not lots of people that were resellers today? Had lots of new mm -hmm. items. Lots of new items. But these were the people getting rid of stuff that... Oh, it looks like his head's cut off. Oh, oh, there, it is. oh there we go. This is from the Postal Service. Like a military doll. United States Postal Service. Postal Service doll. Uh, maybe it's um, um, a mail carrier. I do not know. But he I, doesn't have... We're worried that he might have a hat that that's not with him, but... It's new in the box. Now, from what we saw, none of them had hats. So maybe we got lucky. Okay. Um, so you paid? I paid 20 for this. From the uh, eBayers? From the eBayers. And, and the only thing we saw on it, someone had one listed for $250. 
that's asking and you can ask whatever you want yeah but so we don't really know yes. what it's worth but but we, still we will probably hang on to it for just a little bit do a little bit more homework on it research it and try to find out more here's my i'm trying to get it up